It's been a really good start for Michigan State Volleyball now with a 9-1 non-conference record. That is the best in the Big Ten. So we bring in one of the key cogs to that team here this year. It's sophomore Nia Gross. Thank you for joining us. Let's take a look back first before we, we talk about the conference season. What has impressed you about your team through non-conference play? I think the most thing that has impressed me with our team is the bond that we have together and that how hard we worked over the summer with training, with practicing, with double days, and how far we've come from that and how our practices have paid off and how we're actually doing well as a team and bonding and, and just doing well on the court. Yeah, how has this team grown? Of course, a couple of years ago, you graduated an incredible senior class. What's been the growth from last year to this year? I think the biggest growth is our defense and our scrappiness and our will and determination to want to do well in the Big Ten because I know we were young last year, but that's not an excuse because we are a year older and we've worked so hard and put in so many hours in the gym and in the weight room. So I really think that's the biggest difference from last year to this year. Well, now this Michigan State team will head into conference play and you go to Rec Hall against Penn State. And, and as a freshman, yes. Naya, you never got to play there last year. They came to East Lansing, but you didn't go to State College. What have you been told about the atmosphere at Rec Hall and how to handle it? I've heard that the atmosphere is crazy. I hear they pack the gym and their student section is ridiculously loud and they have a lot of energy, but that's not intimidating at all because we're used to it at um, Jenison. What are a couple of things you got swept last year by Penn State? What are a couple of things you got to do differently this year? I think our defense wise, we are communicating better. We're moving as a unit and together and our hitting and our offense is Ridiculous this year. We have options in every position, so I think that's going to be the biggest thing that ha is going to help us play against them. Well, that's the team story. I want to kind of dive into you as on your personal side, and you got a great opportunity mm -hmm. in the summer to go on the Big Ten foreign tour where they took it yes. one and maybe a couple of players from all the different Big Ten teams. You went to Japan. What cities did you visit, and what kind of experience was that for you this past summer? So we visited Nagoya, Mount Fiji, um, Tokyo was a big one, and one more that I can't remember, but we visited four big cities. And, and what was the biggest experience or the takeaway from that experience for you? The biggest takeaway, I think, was that as though that they're smaller over there, they aren't as tall as the Big Ten, they are very scrappy and they play smarter, as in tips and rolls, and they don't get as high over the net, but they do know how to execute and terminate a play. Well, that's no match, though, for what I am told is called the Almighty Nay Nay, which is your nickname. <laughs> How'd you get that? Yes. My teammates were joking around, and we decided that that's going to be my nickname. And so I was like, it sounds pretty cool, so let's just go with it. <laughs> and it so, stuck. Yeah. <laughs> it did stick. <laughs> oh, yeah, it stuck. You were, uh, you were a player that liked to play a lot of different sports growing up. Why did volleyball stick? Yes. So volleyball sucked because I'm not a big contact person. My mom put me in basketball, soccer, and I really didn't enjoy it at all. So volleyball was something where I can thrive in and also have fun with. So I thought that that would be the best sport for me to, you know, continue to dive into and get better at. All right, final question. Do you like a good block or a good kill mm -hmm. better? Because you're good at both. <laughs> Yeah, I would say I like a good block. Just to deny them and just to see their faces after they thought they were going to get a kill is just very satisfying to me. So I think a good block is something that really, really, I really enjoy. <laughs> the wall that you are in East Lansing, right? Naya, thank you yes. for the time. Appreciate it. Thank you so much.